Mercury is quite a weirdly dark gray. Initially, scientists thought the explanation for its darkness was due to the presence of iron-rich areas. After all, these areas are on the dark spots of the moon. So why not Mercury? Turns out, the scientists were all wrong, when data in 2014 showed that Mercury actually doesn't really have iron, so their explanation made no sense. So, being scientists, they came up with another explanation. Carbon. They were particularly interested in a form of carbon called graphite, which makes up the pencils that all of us use. They ended up confirming this by crashing a probe that was nearing retirement on the surface of the planet, detecting the presence of graphite on Mercury. It's actually quite difficult to see the surface of Venus. It has extremely thick clouds of sulfur that block a lot of visible light. The Soviets had actually ended up landing on Venus in the 70s and 80s, and showed humanity the first glimpses of its surface. It's actually not as orange as you may think. It only looks orange in pictures because a lot of them are taken in different, non-visible wavelengths of light. Astronomers tricked us by turning radio waves into pretty colors. Venus, in reality, looks like this. It's white because those sulfur clouds reflect a bunch of light. Mars is red because of iron oxide. You probably already knew this one. Jupiter actually doesn't have a surface. That's why it's called a gas giant. It still has a large variety of colors though. The orangish colors are sulfur and phosphorus gases that are rising through towards the outside. They form these nice rings due to the insanely quick rotation of the planet, which creates strong jet streams. You'll notice this phenomenon if you spin a ball covered in oil really fast as well. Even Earth has these bands. Saturn is another gas giant. It's more of a yellow-brown and looks similar to Jupiter for basically the same reasons as Jupiter. Its rings, though, have very pretty pinks and browns, and are made of ice, rocks, and dust mostly. Uranus has a very distinctive light blue color. The reason for this is the methane present in Uranus's atmosphere in large quantities. It absorbs red light from the sun, but scatters blue light all around, making the atmosphere look blue. Kind of like how the oceans look blue to us on Earth. Now get ready for the biggest lie of them all. Turns out, Neptune actually looks like this. This is arguably the most depressing image of all time. The old images, according to a pretty recent paper, were not processed correctly for human vision. And after they did their correct processing of the light waves, the blue looks a lot lighter. The reason Neptune is this way is because of the same reason as Uranus, that being methane gases. 